My name is James Williams Jr. And this is Kung Fu Havoc number two. So I've done an experiment all week long. I have gone washing my hair without using grease. Clearly you can see that that's a totally messed up solution. So tonight I'm going to soak my hair in shampoo and wash it all tomorrow and re-grease my hair. My hair is almost shoulder length, which is close but not perfect to how I want it. I'm going to drown this stuff in some soap while I give you guys my Walking Dead review. So did you guys see The Walking Dead? Was it not awesome? Was it not everything it was cracked up to be or was it just me? I liked it. I think you guys might have liked it too. I'm sure you're thinking, why are you using so much shampoo, James? Well, I have a lot of hair, and I'm going to comb through this shampoo soap combination so that tomorrow morning, there'll be no mistake about it, when I jump my ass in that tub, I'll be able to wash this stuff out and grease it. Now, yesterday I was going to do this conditioner thing and keep the conditioner in my hair all day. But it kind of made it a little bit rough to put a ponytail in my hair. So, what do you guys think about The Walking Dead? Yeah, I happy to see Daryl with a crossbow in his hair again. I hope you guys actually saw that before you're watching this. Because if you did, it kind of sucks. As I multitask about the whole hair thing. You know. Now, I know you guys are thinking, um, why the long hair? And I say, well, you know, I think that um, as a person who's going back to his Native American roots, um, I had the right to wear the hairstyle that I so choose to want to wear. And if you don't like that, well, you don't have to support it because it's not your hair, it's mine. Simply put, it's mine. Do I have too much soap in there? Quite possible. I'm going to find out in a New York minute comb through it one good time and then wrap it up with my um, survivor uh, headband ah, dry the soap off my hands don't worry when I comb through I'm going to put the excess soap on this towel so that I can um Straight. In my next video, I really want to get into details on some stuff, but for now, you know, <coughs> um, The Walking Dead totally rocked, and I mean, it totally rocked, so hopefully you guys were down with that, and you actually saw everything, and if you didn't, then I'm totally sorry about that, but it is what it is, just like what I'm about to do is what it is. Kind of got to stay away from the computer because I don't want this soapy mess going on there. So you guys see curls kink too. This is why I need to grease my hair. hear that it's a bunch huh well, there's nothing like a good hair regiment just gotta be able to keep the soap out of my eyes as I do this stuff for us who have been blessed and I have exactly black hair with that combo of all three hairs, which is what I have. Now you see the struggle. You know, curly hair is good and everything on someone else. So now I got to struggle to comb it all to the back. Yeah, 
This is what happens when you don't grease your hair. Well, if I keep it close, it's straight as hell. But that's not going to work for me because I promised my dad that I would grow my ponytail back and that I wouldn't stop growing my hair until I was 50, which gives me seven years to work on. I also have a really cheap comb. I need to know where the hell I can actually buy a real comb. And yeah, my soap did come from the Dollar Tree. I'm poor, so you know, I gotta shop wise, I gotta pinch my pennies and stuff. Rock a mullet. And now here comes the fun part. I'm gonna get this excess towel to go over my head, like so. Watch carefully. And that'll keep the soap off my forehead, off my neck. Brush it a little bit to the back. And when I come back on, it will be wrapped up. I'm James Boone Jr. Just come back number two. Hope you enjoyed that little bit about the walking dead that I did. Mostly I got caught up in doing my hair with all this soap and crap. So, be seeing you.